Edward Street was transformed into a slipway slide to raise money for the RNLI, the Royal National Lifeboat Institution. More than 2,000 hopefuls texted in to try to secure a ride down the slide, but only 360 were the lucky winners. The RNLI said they hoped the event would be a fun way to raise money and awareness for their charity. It's been really good actually, great, great atmosphere, um, real variety of people, um, some people have kind of come from quite far away, um, but yeah, really keen to kind of get involved with the RNLI, which is, which is fantastic. Dressed in a dazzling array of outfits, sliders were buoyed along by bouncy lilos, and at the end of the day they were joined by Brighton's own lifeboat team. However, it might not have been quite the supersonic slide that some were expecting, as some of the sliders did need an extra push to get to the bottom. But that didn't seem to worry the lucky ticket holders, who all seemed to enjoy this one-off experience. My uh, lilo deflated halfway down, but I, I think I had good technique if it wasn't for the lilo deflating. It's great, really good day. Good, really raising awareness for the RNLI and bringing a better friend for Brighton. So it's been a great day for Brighton and the RNLI. They've raised money in a fun and unique way, over £2,000. And despite the weather not being at its best, over 300 people came down to ride that slide. We've seen people in fancy dress, crocodile outfits, in their boxers, wearing sombreros. Even the lifeboat team came down to play their part. Who would have thought that the activity of riding down the slide would keep people in such high spirits and for a good cause? I'm Jordan Burns for University News.